You guys, she's gonna have a quest bar for the first time. And, and she has coffee, so this is like my two favorite things to do right here. <laughs> well, okay, so hold on, just wait. Because I didn't have anything to eat. She hasn't had breakfast. You guys, it's 1040 and she hasn't eaten anything. <sighs> <laughs> Who's watching this? My YouTube channel. Uh oh. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Women just like us who are struggling because we like to eat and drink. <laughs> okay, she's gonna eat it, you guys. Are you sure this is helpful? <laughs> Are you sure? Hi guys. So, I was debating on picking up the camera or not because I haven't really vlogged today because I've been so busy. And then Faith and I got together and um, ideas started busting out of our face. <laughs> And we are so excited. We have some incredible ideas that we've come up with. Man, it smells like Old Spice in this aisle. Yeah. Um, but we're in Target right now. And I was, um, well, we immediately went to the makeup section because that's always where I'm drawn. And Faith was asking me, like, you know, oh, I really need a lipstick or I really need a eyeliner. And um, basically, we just started going through the aisles and I was just showing her some of the inexpensive um, drugstore products that I love that I think she would love and so she got them so for her blog post on Tuesdays that she does every Tuesday Finding Faith um, she's going to show you guys some of the products that she ended up picking up and you know kind of what she feels about them and um, and there's some of my favorite products and um, yeah so and you know we're picking up random things along the way because it's Target and that's what you do here at Target you spend a hundred dollars on a bunch of stuff that you have no idea where it what it is so Here's Faith. Hi, Faith. <laughs> and um, there's her basket full of randomness. But she's got all makeup. these like different makeup and products. And we're going to go take some pictures of the products and um, so that you guys can see it on the blog. So check that out every Tuesday. Um, you know, we'll post those products. So let's get out of this men's section because I smell a lot of man. A lot of man. Anyways, you got to love Target. Now that they have food, it's like it's almost... Oh, there's a toothpaste. Did you know toothpaste? Anyways, I got a lot of updates for you guys. Um, this past weekend was amazing, and I'm working on the vlogs. Sorry they are taking so long, but you'll have already seen it if you're watching this one. So, um, yeah. Anyways, I will talk to you guys later. So, I told Faith to try out this Rimmel Scandalize. Um, did you get the waterproof? I don't know. Yeah, you probably did. Is it? Did you get the black? She doesn't even know. Anyways, I told her to get this. And then I also told her to try one of the Wet n Wild lipsticks because they're so good. And then I told her, I think that was it over here. Oh, you know what else is really good? Actually, better than the e.l.f. one? I would get one of these. Um, I love this one. Heather Silk's really good. Or actually, this one's my favorite, Pearlescent Pink. Their blushes are amazing. Instead of the up. elf, yeah. And they're, be careful because it'll crack. They're really, you know, this isn't. <laughs> um, this one's really, or you could do Heather Silk, which is kind of like the one that, from elf, but this is my favorite. Um, but be careful because it is pigmented when you put your brush in there. Um, anyways. Thank you guys from Instagram. We are here and they have the new Trident Layers yeah. Limited Edition Pumpkin Spice. I know. It's very exciting. I had to get Faith the... It's a great moment. <laughs> it's a great moment. <laughs> I haven't tasted it yet, so we'll see. <laughs> and then has have any of you guys tasted this peanut butter before? Peanut butter and co? No. Peanut it's funny, I was looking at the ingredients and this has less fat, less calories, and less sugar than... Um, like the Sutter's, Lauren Sutter's, yeah. or you know, like the unsweetened natural peanut butter. So, what's the catch? All right, guys, here's the products. She's gonna try the dish soap and hand soap. the hand soap. All right, we're in the journal section, guys, and um, these mole skins are fantastic to have like in your purse. I really like these, and I've used them. Um, but then also we found like these really, really cute ones, like this one, I can't sleep journal. And just says, I can't sleep tonight, and it has like little quotes in it and stuff. But what I really wanted was like a journal for our our whole like thing that we're trying to build here. This one's kind of cute. I know you guys are going to be like, Shana, didn't you just buy a journal? 
<laughs> but that was a journal for my fitness stuff. That was, no, that was a, that wasn't a journal. It was a calendar. See? See? I did not buy one. I need a journal. Tell me when. Oh, oh you're, you're I on. <laughs> you're on, Faith. I am looking for just a small journal to put in my purse. I have a lot of journals at home, too. I like to do art journaling and decorate them, but I just want something that I have in my purse that for I can quick just notes. write quick notes on. So I'm looking for anything that just kind of pops up, you know, pops out to me. Um, I'm kind of liking this one, mm -hmm. but we'll see. Pen. And then you're like, oh look, there's a zipper on yeah, my planner. Yeah, there's a zipper, so you can have your and pen in there. Why do know. I just? Why do I love that canvas could be our <gasps> like paint stuff on that? Well, but. Why is it the canvas is something that I'm inspired by? Like that's part of our decorative for yeah. the project. Yeah. You guys, you guys are gonna love this project, by the way. You're gonna love it. <laughs> um, Just and I'm kind of I really don't like pink, but for some reason this neon and the tan is yeah. really. I just like the canvas because I really want to paint on it. I love canvas. <laughs> All right, it's settled. Now, you know what would be nice to have with this planner is a little notebook. Yeah. <gasps> that goes in the zipper. That's where we write our notes. Oh, yeah. But the planner is our sheet. No, I almost just said it. I almost just said oh, it. Oh, we can't give it away. It's a secret. Don't open this up, though. Like. All right, so I guess I could do a really quick haul. I grabbed some of this cocoa coconut with Kemet Corazon wheat granola. Some of the honey almond flax granola. Kale for kale chips. I will make some and I'll let you guys know. I grabbed some blueberries. I grabbed that white chocolate wonderful peanut butter. I grabbed the planner for our project. Some pencils for my sketching of my collection, which I can't believe I can say that. Um, the contouring and bronzing powder from e.l.f. I really love. Just replacing my one and a half. I grabbed some hand soap because we're almost out of the Myers. I grabbed the chocolate hazelnut um, Justin's butter. And the almond butter of the vanilla almond butter. The candle by Myers. I grabbed three of the matte lipsticks, the new ones by uh, Maybelline. I grabbed Lust for Blush. Siren and Scarlet, and Nude Embrace. I also grabbed this, I hope I don't already have it, the Cobalt Blue Infallible. I have the really like turquoisey one. These little um, notebooks, pocket notebooks. That gum, Trident Layers Pumpkin Spice. A pencil sharpener. Oh, is that it? And I think that's it. So yeah. I'm gonna get some dinner and go to bed. But I'm excited to share with you guys what our project is. And yeah. Alright. Okay. Hi guys. Um I'm not really even sure if you, the light you guys can see me. Um but today is Wednesday and I do not think that I vlogged at all yesterday. Just trying to get back on a schedule. Every time I do something really exciting, I feel like I then fall into like a deep depression and it's like time for a new project. So anyways, um, I am getting ready to go over to my dad's house. It is Rosh Hashanah, um, the uh, Jewish New Year. And um, yeah, so I just thought I'd say hello. Um, I still need to get my cardio in, so that's gonna have to happen tonight when I get home, which really, really sucks. But um, yeah, I'm feeling okay. And it's actually really, really quite nice outside, so I thought I'd wear shorts. I never wear shorts, but I don't feel like wearing any of my skirts right now. It's weird. I don't really know how to explain it. Um, but I figured, yeah. So I am just wearing this top that I got at um, Forever 21, and it's got these, like, sheer arms. I don't know if you can see it. But I'm in love with it, and it's just, like, a T-shirt style top. So just that. And then these blue shorts I got at Marshall's. Um, during our Marshalls trip, if you guys watch my other um, YouTube channel, Thrifters Anonymous, I picked those up. And then, of course, my 
um, shoes I wear every day. <laughs> and they're nude, and I just kind of like them with this outfit. And then I just have a ring on from um, H&M. Oh, and can we talk about this lipstick? Um, that vlog will probably have already been up when you watch this. Um, Faith and I went to Target, and I picked up those... Um, the matte, Maybelline matte lipsticks, the new ones. And this one is in Siren and Scarlet. And it kind of reminds me of Ruby Woo. Not gonna lie. Except not as drying. It's really pretty. I don't really wear a lot of red lipstick, but I felt like it today because it's a holiday and we're fancy. I'm fancy, right? My hair's dirty, but, my, but I am fancy. Um. I also went to Sprouts last night to pick up some kosher desserts I'm supposed to take over to my dad's. And um, they had some really cute little like apple streusels and they're all parv, meaning no, no milk because you cannot milk, mix milk and dairy. So anyways, um, sadly, or not sadly, but um, I have made the, this decision to stay on my prep. Um, so I packed my food got my dinner and then I made a protein pancake that I'm gonna have here in about 20 minutes and then make myself a cup of coffee to go and yeah that's kind of what's going on right now so I'll fill you guys in I had a really good workout at um, Stacy's gym last night at 18 training and um, she just got third place in the uh, Olympia and she's just really inspiring really I was trying to explain to her what my dilemma is, and I couldn't even explain it because I don't really know what my dilemma is. And she's like, I'm just trying to understand what you're saying. And I'm like, if I knew what I was saying, I, it probably would make sense. <laughs> so I'll fill you guys in. It has to do with like just this whole competition thing and you know, what am I doing exactly? Because I still am not clear about that. Let me find my car keys and then um, I will take you guys with me. And maybe I'll show you guys some of the holiday stuff. So my dad's cooking and he always makes incredible food. So yeah. All right, I'll see you there. Hey guys, so we're at my dad's house and each plate has been set up. And we got the Kiddush cup and the apple and cranberry for a sweet new year with honey. It's all traditional and then we have a shofar and then here's the table. Oh, wow. sister, you baked. I baked. Oh, she looks so like it. <laughs> Very proud. Whoa, well, okay, you just stole her thunder. Look at him. It's hard. It's not even edible. Hers is at least edible. I know. Thank you. That's amazing. I can't. That's been years. I know. It's the first one I ever made. That's really good. My sister baked. I think my dad's jealous because he can't bake. I mean, he can kind of bake. Okay. This my dad's famous salmon. And then he puts these peppers on there. Yeah, look. We're gonna put a little bit of this. Carrot. I'm in the bathroom because there's so many people in here. Um, it is day two of Rosh Hashanah and I'm at my dad's place and I just wanted to show you what I was wearing. You can't really see everything but I'm wearing this sequin vintage top. I'm in love with sequins if you guys don't already know and as it starts to get cooler outside I bust out all my vintage sequins and new sequins. Um, yeah so just a, bit, a sequin talk. I got it Goodwill and then some leather shorts. And then I'm wearing my Zara heels, if you guys can see them. <laughs> I'm going to post a picture on Instagram, but anyways, time for dinner.
Hi guys. So, I hope you are going out and I just thought I'd show you what I'm wearing. I'm wearing the new leather um, jacket I got at Salvation Army. Um, the little top that I got at Forever 21. My American Eagle jeans and the same shoes I wear every day. I really need to wear some other shoes. Um, yeah, so, oh, and I'm wearing that lipstick and I brought it with me to tell you guys the name. Siren in Scarlet. That's in wearing. Oh, oh my god. Okay. I need to go eat before I kill myself. Good morning. It is Sunday. And I think the last time I picked up the camera was yesterday before date night. We went to see Lucy. Um, it was actually really good. It was the guy who wrote Fifth Element, which is one of my favorite movies. And um, I enjoyed it. So I haven't been to the movies in so long that if it was that bad, I probably wouldn't have noticed because I was just happy to be at the movie theater. I did allow myself to eat something that was not on the plan because I haven't talked to you guys. And I just... Um, I will talk to you guys about it, but I'm feeling good. Uh, I'm getting ready to go to the gym and meet Faith. I'm so excited. I haven't met her all week. So I just wanted to show you guys what I was wearing. I'm wearing one of those new sports bras from, don't mind my hair, it's kind of ratty, um, from a Aloe. Um, it's the, God, I can't remember the name of it, but it's the one that's got that cool back. Oh, you can't even see it. The cool back. And then I'm wearing those cozy orange black pants. I need to buy another pair, you guys, because I'm in love with them. I feel like they're so flattering and they're so comfortable. Um, and I'm just wearing my Nikes. These are a little bit more comfortable than the other ones that I got. Those fly knits are awesome, by the way, um, but they're not really, like, super comfy, like, for working out. Um, I think they're more, I feel like they're just cute and light. I'd wear them, I don't know. I've only had one cup of coffee, so I don't know what I'm saying right now. Um, and then I'm just wearing a cut-up shirt. I love this Pac-Man shirt that I got at Savers. And, yeah, so had a really good day yesterday. I met up with Edwina, and um, we did some filming. We did a haul video. We haven't done a haul video since I started filming for um, YouTube, like, a really long time ago. And um, can I just tell you, it was a disaster. We were all over the place. Like, what I mean by all over the place, I mean like, we would start showing like a shirt, but then we'd start talking about how, to, I mean, <laughs> you'll see. And it's really long. I'm, I'm trying to think like, should I chop it down or should I just keep it? Because it's a bunch of nonsense. And um, yeah, so anyways, like I said, I'm just getting ready to go meet Faith. And I'll take you guys with me. I'm not sure if I'm gonna film a whole bunch. Um, because I haven't seen her, so I like kind of want to catch up with her. But um, let me get my stuff in order. I feel like whenever I'm talking to you guys, I can't, I can't focus because I'm like trying to multitask. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah. So I will see you guys in a bit. All right, bye. Hey guys, so my aunt is here, but I wanted to show you what I did for her. I got her as a care package. Actually, I'll show it to you after I give it to her. That way she doesn't see everything. But we're going to start our little thing. And I didn't film with Faith. Sorry. We had a really good workout. We just were catching up. But anyways, I will fill you guys in. All right, bye. I did. All right guys, she doesn't want to be on camera yet. But I know that at the end of this, she's going to be like, can you put me on camera so everybody <laughs> can see me? But my aunt is here and Sasha's here because Sasha likes my aunt. And um, her care package is in here. It's not Mary Kay. This is just a bag that I had, but I thought it was a really cute little bag. And this is her care package to start her journey. This is, she's starting her journey. Aren't you guys excited for her? Because <laughs> I, this is, this is a lot. And I know it's not going to be easy, but she's going to love it. So, I got your little care package. And I want you to go through it while I'm filming, but we won't put you on the camera. But I want you to just pull out things, and then I'll explain to you what they are. So, okay, this is going to be your little journal, okay, and you're going to, we're going to write down like all your goals and your, you know, dreams and anything that you want, and also, um, it can be part of your food journal, Okay. but I like as if it's in your purse. Oh, you're right. Okay. Especially after I buy my new purse. Okay, these are just some samples of protein. You don't really, I want you to use food right now, um, but... Protein's kind of fun too because you can make like shakes with fruit 
Get and meal. and it's like a dessert, yeah. And those are lactose free. Thank goodness. And this is I thought was just really funny. It's get a grip, but it's one of those things to open jars because you'll be opening up I like need... hot sauce jars. But I think it's cute because it I says get a grip. That. This is to write your groceries. It says with precise planning and my 401k plan, I'm, I will be able to retire in 150 years. <laughs> This is, this is your new planner. Oh so I love that this has a little pocket here so you can keep your pens and any like inspiring things you have. And then I have something in the car for you. But we're going to today, we're going to take the planner and we're going to obviously go to the date that is it is. And then, um, okay, Sophie, I hear you. And then we're going to go to the calendar and we're going to write down the days. And then what I like about here too is you can fill in, you know, what you did today, what, you know, what you ate that day, whatever. And I just really thought this was really cute. And again, it's small enough to where you can kind of still keep it with you. These are my, f this is my favorite oatmeal. <laughs> I no longer eat Quaker crap food um, because it has a lot of GMOs in it. This is delicious. GMOs. This is like the, um, what do you mean GMOs? Uh, we will go into that later. Yeah. This is like the oatmeal you get in a restaurant. Oh, okay. Okay. And it's delicious, but this is going to be made on a stove top. Okay, or it can be put in the microwave, but the stove top's a little bit better. Um, but it is microwavable. Perfect. Okay, and that's my favorite oatmeal. You can get that at Costco. Okay, these <laughs> are emergency. <laughs> are the they call them clean cheats clean because cheats. it's the cleanest bar that you'll ever eat. The amount of sugar is that's what you're looking always. So you look at the sugars, one gram. Right. You look at the calories, 180 calories, and you look at the fat grams. This tastes like heaven. And if you have a microwave and you I put do. them on a plate and you put them in a little microwave and you get a fork out, it's like eating, you can make cookies. So these are delicious. And you can buy these obviously wherever. They're you can get them at the nutrition store only. Um, I thought this was really cute and I had it. So I was like, <laughs> you don't wear color, but I think this is your time to bring color into your life. And it's a cute little pashmina scarf. But it's just, um, it's a, the, the idea is that you're bringing color. Right? Yes, I am. Because you're going to want people to look at you because you are going to be amazing. <clears throat> okay, what else do we got in here? I think that's it. Is that it? Oh, my goodness. I hope so. Okay, I, I think, think that's it. it. Sasha, I think this is it. Sasha, I think she... she... Yeah, Ooh, they're waiting for that? food. That's Oscar's. Oh. You met Oscar? No. You didn't meet Oscar? I don't He was at Thanksgiving. Oh, okay, then I had not Oscar. He looks like a man now. <laughs> He's all grown up. Do you like your planner? We're going to take this oh, with you. Yeah. Thing. Oh, bless you, Oscar's. And then we're gonna take this one too. Actually, yeah, we'll take both of these. Um, and then we'll keep that in there. So that's your your bags, you guys. Okay, well, I wanted you guys to you. see. Um, yeah, so anyways, here you eating it. You guys, she's gonna have a Quest Bar for the first time. Ever. And she has coffee, so this is like my two favorite things to do right here. <laughs> well, okay, so hold on, just wait. Because I didn't have anything to eat. She hasn't had breakfast. You guys, it's 1040 and she hasn't eaten anything. <sighs> <laughs> Who's watching this? My YouTube channel. Uh oh. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Women just like us who are struggling because we like to eat and drink. <laughs> okay, she's gonna eat it, you guys. Are you sure this is healthy? <laughs> are you kidding? Are you serious? <laughs> Do you guys hear her? What did you put? What did they put in it? Deliciousness. They bake it themselves. They make them themselves. Wow. She's freaking you out. You know, if I could just eat one of these, like, all, throughout the day, that'd be good. After my competition, or after Olympia, I came home and put three on a plate. <laughs> and just ate them. It's not good. You don't want to do that. You'll blow. I mean, it, listen, it's still processed. It's not food. You're not eating a chicken breast and veggies. I'm doing But. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I mean, this is not even a joke. She's never had a Quest Bar, you guys. Mm-mm. I used to have those other ones, those power bars, you know? Yeah, but they're filled with junk. Even though, again, and this, this still has like sugar crap. alcohols. This isn't like free from, you guys know what I mean. Anyways, she loves it. I knew she would. I'm gonna have one too, I think. Don't tell anybody, <laughs> as I'm telling everybody. And I love to eat it with my cup of coffee. Like, it's just oh, like, no, the, this, it's... Is like... <laughs> this is ridiculous. It's just like, this is like life changing. So anyways, wow. all right, we're gonna go to Sprouts now. So this, you guys, is what my car has. Supplements, coffee, and almonds. <laughs> You're find that. You guys, she's trying to explain to me the Quest Bar. <laughs> she's like, they've provided you with, you know, a fulfilling, and I'm like, you mean goodness? You mean chunks of chocolate? They're providing you with chunks of chocolate. Is what they're providing you with. 
and volume. And, and volume. Uh-huh. And chewiness. And chewiness. <laughs> it's very important. It's very important when you're eating bars. It is. And drinking your coffee at the same time. <laughs> See, you know we're family when we like need our coffee and then we take a bite and then we take a sip and it's all together. That's what all right. Anyways. Down. I remember when Stevie um, and Jason lived up off the... Uh, off all right, guys, our sprouts experience has come to an end. But I bought myself some flowers. Look how pretty. And um, I think Eliane enjoyed herself. She got everything she needed. All right, guys, we meal prepped everything for her. And then I'm going to give her one of these sunflowers on her journey. And we've got all her food prepped. And I'm so excited for her. I'm getting ready for Magical Madness. We're going to go dance. And I will take you guys with Hey, guys, so we are downtown. And we're getting ready to film the, the end of Sherlock's. If you guys follow me, I am in a dance company, Magical Madness. You guys can follow them on Facebook. And there is a YouTube channel as well. And the hubby is going to be uh, filming us. And um, we're doing like pieces that are left of the film, essentially. So we're downtown. I'll show you some of it. I love downtown. I was born and raised in Las Vegas. So it's close to my heart. I don't know what that means, but... <laughs> Anyways, I'm in a, like a really happy mood. My aunt was so excited and I gave her that um, sunflower and she just, I could just tell she's just really excited to make a change. I think she's totally over it and wants to do this. And that is the only time you can really do this when you want to do it because it is a lot of work. But she was so excited when I prepped her meal. She's like, oh my gosh, the meal is ready. It's like, how can you fail? I'm like, well, there's a lot of ways you can fail. <laughs> but I won't tell you those. <laughs> Um, I did allow her to get granola, but I told her my story about how like when I get granola, I like eat the whole bag. I'm like, I'm not allowed granola in the house. Like there's just certain things you can't have in the house. And for her, it's cheese. She's like, I can't. I'm like, don't worry, cheese is not part of the plan. <laughs> but um, anyways, I am gonna get ready, but uh, yeah. So we're just scouting the area. We're looking for like an alleyway to film. And um, yeah, this is downtown. This is Fremont Street. This little uh, La Comida restaurant is a really cute little restaurant downtown. Anyways, yeah, we're just scouting the area. And this is like a cute little like alleyway. Really cute. Yeah, this is perfect. This is great photo shoot area. <laughs> Anywhere where there's trash cans and dirt. Is it someone can literally come out from the sides? Yeah. I like that. I think that works. But I, th I feel like it's one continuous shot. Yay, they're here. Somebody's here like this, and boom, boom, and you come out as I see because I'm, I'm here. As the personality comes And somebody's in. here. We're seeing this person here coming out, and it's in, in the boom, boom, and then we're, we're going. And then out comes, and then they see this like right here up against the wall. Like no trespassing. We do need a male dancer. TJ's moving here. Really? He's gonna be a dancer. Oh, it. that would be awesome. <laughs> well, that's cool. Yeah. Okay. Moses is cooler okay, than cool. my entrance. Okay. Now I gotta do something. We're ready. Are we ready for our first scene, ladies? We're ready. Yes. We're gonna get this done. Done. I had seen was I didn't think we'd have an alley so I thought we'd be literally walking on the street and peep at each dancer would just like walk in from from the road I guess yeah, I don't know like, <laughs> we, just like we didn't figure out the logistics of it behind we'd have this diagonal there's the baby <laughs> <laughs> We might get called out for more, but 
Nothing has. Well, I'm actually really quite happy with that end shot as long as it works well. Yeah. So I think I think that's official. It's a wrap. Finny. <laughs> it's a finny. <laughs> finny. Finny. Uh, Yay! Now, now all we have to do is some editing. <laughs> A little, a little it's bit all of the putting just it a, together. Just a few. Just a little bit. Yeah, well, hey. it's all worth it. Yeah, okay, it, is. So it is. For the past 12 weeks, I've been uh, training. It's about doing this for yourself. And every single morning, every single hour, you've got to re-inspire yourself. About four or five years ago, my mother ended up passing away. I just had lost a piece of me, that thing that wakes you up and keeps you going. And just being active was one of them. Normally, I would have just stopped or quit. I didn't. So you guys, 